Everything about the Broncos coaching search and assistant coaching search has been different this time around. Sean Payton, it took a while for the Broncos to settle on him. But since he took over, he said, I'm going to take a slow to hire, quick to fire approach, create accountability. He wanted guys with experience. He interviewed three former head coaches for his defensive coordinator job, Rex Ryan, Matt Patricia, and Vance Joseph. He is hiring Vance Joseph, the former Broncos head coach, to take over. Now listen, Vance to me got a bit of a raw deal as the head coach of the Broncos in two years. He went 11 and 21. He deserved to be fired based on the record. We all understand that. But the reality is he was inheriting a team that was aging rapidly, the roster was declining, and they had two of the worst drafts in the history of the franchise. Oh, and by the way, he was drinking out of a fire hose. He was overmatched, but he didn't get to pick his coaching staff. So being undermined by his coaches, not having the roster, it all led to 11 and 21. But he said this past year when Arizona was here, he didn't harbor any grudges. He said, I didn't win enough. That he looked forward to the opportunity to play him back in Denver. And as this process played out, he had an eight hour interview with Sean Payton. He told me after that interview that he was hopeful that he would land the Denver job. He then interviewed with the Eagles two days this week. It looked like he was gonna have his choice between the Eagles or the Broncos. On Thursday, he chose the Broncos, or you could say they chose him, however you phrase it. But Vance is looking forward to this chance. He's excited. Pat Sertan, the star corner, said, I can't wait to look and work with him. So this is going to be interesting because Vance, Broncos country, they're not going to have any patience. They remember him as a head coach. And defensively, his track record isn't outstanding, but he's had some good defenses in Arizona in 2020 and 2021 top 11 and 12 in points allowed. So there is something there. But I believe the mesh with Sean Payton is critical. Payton is a disciplinarian. And you have a guy that has basically that stature that can command a room like Vance Joseph. They should, in theory, be able to work together. Keep an eye on this also. Matt Patricia interviewed for the DC job. Could he land as a linebackers coach for Vance Joseph? I was told by multiple sources that was a possibility. But regardless, Vance Joseph, is the Broncos' new D.C. He's the first Broncos' former head coach to be the D.C. since Wade Phillips. All Phillips did was lead the Broncos to the Super Bowl 50 crown. If Broncos and Joseph could get back to the playoffs, the vitriol from Broncos country would go away. Reporting from UC Health Training Center, Troy Ray, Denver 7.